What's up guys, I'm the Arcanaut and welcome back to Batman the Telltale series. We just, Oswald, well we think that Oswald shot the uh, Falcone and we're going to the skyline where Oswald is to see if this is so. You lot, come check out this office. Nobody heard any of that commotion. Where is I don't know? Where the door. Oh. Oh. You can help me, or you <laughs> let him go. Batman! It's about time! You kill a crime boss, you'd expect a word of thanks from Gotham's number one vigilante. Oh, don't worry, I'll pass your gratitude on to those who made it happen. They'll be pleased to know you think so highly of their work. I said let him go. You hear that, Roland? That sounded like an order. I'll crush him. Now, now, have a little respect for the bat. Think he underestimates you. Is this about Falcone? We all saw how you felt about Falcone. Pounded him into a pulp on live TV. If you were truly the defender of this city, you'd have finished the job yourself. Admit it, Falcone deserved to die. Vermin like Falcone, they deserve to be stomped out. Believe me, I know. You don't decide who lives and who dies. That's not justice. But it's bloody well satisfying, isn't it? As a show of good faith, I'm gonna let this one go. How's about we talk this through? We helped you with Falcone. Now, if we could just cut out the rest of the rot, like Wayne and Hill, ordinary folks might be able to breathe. What is it about this place that attracts criminal scum like you? You're going to attack the mayor? That's not going to happen. Attack? Absolutely not. Mayor Hill's role has been decided. Here's the thing. I actually admire you, Batman. We both want the same kinds of things. Me and my people, we've got big plans for Gotham. It looks like a douchebag. They found Catwoman. What do you want with her? We had a deal. She didn't make good on it. So sorry this didn't work out, mate. I'd stay to watch. I would, but I still got a Catwoman problem to deal with. Oh, what's her name again? Selena. Yes! Oh, beautiful name. <laughs> <laughs> Near ugly. You gonna let me through? Ow. Oh, oh. Damn it, Crush. Gonna have to try harder than this. my head open that I tried to do that. Oh, sorry, my bad, my bad. Alfred, track down Selena Kyle. I'll 
Starfighter right away. No, Alfred. Uh, now! I really enjoy this game so far. I know, uh, I think a lot of people gave it, a, uh, gave it some crap, but uh, I've liked it so far. I still think The, the Walking Dead is probably my favorite, though. <laughs> Need to talk to you urgently. Stack deck, 6 p.m., no case. But I like my cape. I should be able to wear my cape. Whenever the hell I want to. I'm mad, man. Do whatever the hell I want to do. Uh, wasn't we just in a loading screen like two seconds ago? as Harvey Dent backer Bruce Wayne comes under fire for alleged corruption. Joining me live is Mayor Hamilton Hill. Mr. Mayor, you said earlier today that in light of the allegations against him, Bruce Wayne should distance himself from Dent, but that was unlikely to happen. Why? He strikes me as, well, the jealous sort. Very possessive of his toys. Better keep a low profile. Probably be fair, Cops raided his house. <laughs> Brucey. You lost? Because I don't have time for tourists. Looks like you walked into the wrong bar. Do you know Selena Kyle? There are men after her. Uh-huh. When aren't there? Well, these ones are mm. trying to kill her. Hey. Don't I know you? It is you. Knew it. The cops take all your fancy clothes? <laughs> are you trying to lay low? Of course, you're not really the low-lying type. Nice to meet you. Uh... Frank. Yeah. Funny seeing you here. So much in the papers. Whole other thing, meeting the man in real life. You're uh, shorter than I thought you would be. Leave him alone, Frank. Man's just trying to have a quiet drink. He didn't seem to mind the company. Whatever. I didn't mind the company. I meet new people. Selena, I need to tell you something important. Better be an apology. You were supposed to take care of our mutual problem. Instead, you just pissed him off. That's why I'm here. You're in danger. I've had rats on my tail all day. The man who hired you. His name is Oswald Cobblepot. Never heard of him. He goes by Penguin. Penguin? Shit. Ugh, you've got to be kidding me. You should have just killed me on that rooftop. I'm dead anyway. When you screw someone over, you really screw them. The Penguin. <laughs> penguin can't take on both of us, and I'm not going anywhere. Clearly you know something about him. I only know him by reputation. I'm surprised you never heard of him. He's a big deal across the pond. He's more dangerous than you think. I grew up with Oz. He's the first real friend I ever had. I'm not surprised. Questionable morals and a penchant for theatrics? You two have a lot in common. Hmm. The question is, why Gotham? Why now? It's not like he's hurting for crime syndicates abroad. Why leave that? Hmm. He thinks he's changing the world for the better, no matter the cost. Well, he's no Joan of Arc, that's for sure. Well, I'm not sticking around here to find out. Oswald, Penguin is about to unleash God knows what on the city. You can't just leave. A good reason not to be here when he does. You want to stay? That's your choice. If Penguin is everything you say, there's no tree high enough for you to climb. He will find you. So what are you suggesting? The bat helps the cat. And the cat helps the bat. 
Bruce, sweetie, the gallant knight thing, it really is adorable. But what would Harvey think? The two of us working together? After all, I'm not really an all work and no play kind of girl. Harvey knows that. You and Harvey, it's pretty clear you aren't just friends. Please, I'm just toying with him. I only take my claws out for someone special. Hmm. You and I... Who brings a vest to a, to a bar fight? Why are you gonna dress like a 50s hitman? Oh, well, Bruce, you were right. Selena Kyle, Penguin says hello. Hello. Beat it. We're here for her. Okay. Let's get up, Lee. If you care about your own skin, you'll get the hell out! Get up and keep trying. I think they want more. Then let's give it to them. God, fuck this. I'm going home. Some noodles, sit and watch TV. You fight pretty good for such a pretty boy. Oh. Come on, this way. Don't sound too excited. Chick. That's why I couldn't be a part of a gang or anything like that. Quick, check the alleyway! You see anything? I'd witness, Negative. witness Let's somebody the get side. their ass kicked. And I'd be like, yeah, I ain't doing that. But like if somebody in my house was getting their ass kicked. Yeah, we're, we're alone. Let's get out of here. I'll take the rooftops. You take the alley. Tell me what Wait. to do, woman. Just... 
stay out of trouble. <laughs> now where's the fun in that? You shouldn't trust me, you know. I don't. Not even a little bit. Alfred, I'm uploading the contents of a smartphone to the back computer. Check to see if there's anything on the phone we can use. Bling. I'm processing it now. Is everything all right? There are quite a few police cars convening on your location. It's fine. Has the back computer found anything yet? Bruce, there are a number of messages here. All from Mayor Hill. Mayor Hill? Uh, the last voicemail is his. Listen to this. I gave you everything I have on Wayne. I've held up my end of the bargain, and I expect you to do the same. This is very shady indeed. Whatever they're talking about, it doesn't sound good. I should have guessed. Hill's working with Penguin. If Hill's talking to Penguin, he must know something. It's time I paid him a visit. I agree. The mayor must have answers, but if I may offer a word of advice, People look up to Batman after how you handle Falcone. Terrorizing the mayor could damage that goodwill. Then again, Batman's methods would certainly get him talking immediately. Bruce would have to depend on his guile to loosen Hill's lips. I don't want to sully the good name of Batman. So. Bruce's name is already sullied, so we'll just go with Bruce. Going as Bruce is the smart choice. I see, like, I don't see how, why he was so surprised that Hill had anything to do with it. Though. Like, he knows Hill that is corrupt, so I mean, why be surprised when he finds out that uh, he has something to do with it? I don't make any sense. Big giant hole. Destruction. I done that. That was my handiwork. Sorry, the mayor's busy. Do you have an appointment? Uh, the mayor's doing debate prep. He really can't be disturbed right now. Uh, Excuse me, Mr. Wayne? You're really telling me that Bruce Wayne needs an appointment? But the mayor... Will be fine. And if he fires, he just come to work for me. Deal? Bruce Wayne? Finally, you've come to see me. Of course, only after your name's been dragged through the mud. Don't get me wrong. I'm glad to see you. But you're a day late and a great many dollars short. This isn't a social call, Hill. I'm here for answers. Well, well, straight to business. And I was going to have Deborah make you a martini. Your father and I, we took this city and made it ours. Falcone too, rest his soul. We built everything we have. You were born with it. A soft boy like you wouldn't understand what it takes to rise to the top. Oh, I understand. Very well. I gave you everything I have on Wayne. I've held up my end of the bargain, and I expect you to do the same. Sounds like me. It is you. So, what's your point? I take it you have one. Or are you just fond of my dulcet tones? You're working with Oswald Cobblepot and his thugs. Working with them? They're a bigger threat to order than those masked freaks. I'm in Cobblepot's crosshairs, same as you. But you fed them dirt on me. Only the files I seized from Wayne Manor. Your father, Falcone, and I, we had ways of getting anything we wanted. How do you think your family got the land for Wayne Tower? Cobblepot wants retribution because we took his family's land. Oswald's family signed it over to us, along with the rest of their assets. If that's true, then Oswald has a right to be angry. Is there any proof? Your father and I hid our tracks quite well. There's so much more I could share, if only we were friends. I could help you deal with Penguin, let you in on some family history. But I'm caught in a dogfight for my political career. 
and my rival has bottomless pockets. Now, if that rival were to say, drop out, or his advertising spend were to dry up, I might have a lot more resources for helping a new friend. Done. Not a chance, Hill. I'm not cutting Harvey loose. Well, you dropped on your head. When the mayor of Gotham extends a hand, you take it. I don't need your hand. Not with your voice on tape. You forget who you're talking to. I'm the man that says I never left such and such a message. And all the judges bow their heads and say, yes, sir. I'm the man who sends the police to your house to take your things, and I give them to whoever I please. You're nothing like your father. You'd never have the backbone to do what we did. I'm the heavyweight, Wayne, and you're punching above your weight. Get out of the ring before you get hurt. I would never stoop so low. My backbone doesn't have the bend. Let me put it this way. If that voicemail makes it to the papers, or anywhere else I don't like, I'll turn my commissioner loose on your lieutenant for that fiasco down at the precinct. Gordon? And then I'll turn him on you and Dent for being there. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a debate to prep for. Get him out of here. You know Harvey is going to embarrass you out there. Dent's campaign is on its last legs. Tonight, it hits the canvas. It's you who's going downhill, and you're not getting back up. Shooting your douchey looking face. Alfred, get a warning to Gordon. Tell him to increase security of the debate. Hill seems to think he's safe, but Penguin's still out there. Else is on here. Go put it right in there, bad man. Find out. This is your case. As per your request, Lieutenant Gordon has tripled security at the debate. Thanks, Alfred. It's a plan of the old Monarch Theater. The auditorium where the debate's being held. Hmm. I hacked into the image feeds from the security cameras at the auditorium. Just to be safe. Just to be safe. Hells, details about your father. They must have been quite upsetting. I can't imagine how you must feel. To learn so much in so little time. To be honest, Alfred, nothing can shock me anymore. Not when it comes to my parents. I wish I felt the same way. But I suppose no good can come from wallowing. The city needs you now, more than ever. Uh, I'll, uh, I'll leave you to it, then. I wish I had a chair that done that. Gotham District Attorney... Wait a minute. The images on these cameras haven't changed. Something's wrong. Penguin's men may have commandeered the cameras on their end. We could just be looking at... What they want us to see. Warn Gordon that he may have visitors. I have to get down there. Now. I swear there's a dog over there. You guys can't see it, but there's a little Mika over here. Come here, Mika. Come here. Come on. Get over there. Harvey needs to get out of there. Okay. 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 Hey, 
Hey, Bruce. Man, I'm glad you called. I needed to talk to you, actually. Something's come up. Something that's... Well, it's not exactly pleasant. Why, why what happened? Are you all right? Me? Oh, yeah, I'm fine. Oh, you mean because of this penguin threat? They have me in some back room until the debate begins. For my own protection, they said. A little bit of a kill, if you ask me. Uh, look. Bruce, I didn't want to do this over the phone, but... My advisors are telling me that I need to... <clears throat> that I need to distance myself from you. Yeah. Until all this mess with your family blows over. I, I get it, it's the smart move, but let's talk about that later. I'm glad you see it that way. What with the allegations in the press, and now this mess with Falcone, you're a liability. But here's the thing, Bruce. Without your money, I am dead in the water. You dig. I know this is a delicate topic, but I need you to keep me afloat. I may have to trash you in public, but you and me, we'll know the truth about our friendship. No matter what, we need a new mayor. Hill needs to be removed. I knew you'd see it that way. Listen, I hate to push you, but I... I need to know. Can I count on your money, Bruce? Dick. Whatever it takes to save Gotham. I'll always support you, Harvey. Oh, thank you, Bruce. You, thank you. You're dick. You don't know how much this means to me. To Gotham. I'm sorry, Bruce. The makeup person is here. I guess she needs to put on my face. I hope you can still watch the debate somewhere. Uh, no matter what I have to say tonight, remember, you are always my friend. What a dick. Like, uh, I can't hang out with you no more, but, uh, I need your money. That's a dick thing to do. Batman? Yeah, all quiet so far. I've got a feeling that's about to change. I'm glad I took a chance on this... this collaboration of ours. Keep on doing what you're doing, and the rest of Gotham will start to see you like I do. A hero. Uh, hero is a lofty title. I hope I live up to it. Could be tonight's the night to prove it. We have bigger things to worry about right now. Your security has been compromised. I've got patrols on every door. You better check on them. But then you damn sugar, I could check I'd keep on that holstered if I were you. Doors. What's she doing here? She was part of that robbery at the mayor's office. Really? You're gonna drag out that dead horse? We're all on the <laughs> same side, Jim. Uh, this better not come back to bite me. Alpha Patrol, oh, what come it, Jim? in. I'm that, Batman. Um, incident in the bar. Dead is its own kind of cage. I can't stand being in it. Not that I needed your help or anything, but you had my back. I thought I'd repay the favor. You know, like you scratch my back, I cut some people up. You don't owe me anything. Those scum had it coming. And they say chivalry is dead. None of my men on the ground are responding. Enough waiting. We're going in. Alpha, do you read? Now aren't you glad I'm here? Yeah. Well, you have a better shot than my SWAT team of getting in there quietly. We are seriously underfunded at the GCPD. Sounds like a vote for Dent, Lieutenant. I want one of those voice masks like that. That way I can walk around with a grumbly voice all the time. That'd be awesome. Wait a minute. There you go. Good evening, everyone, and welcome to our live debate for the next mayor of Gotham City. This is an important debate for these two candidates. Incumbent Mayor Hamilton Hill 
and the challenger, Gotham District Attorney Harvey Dent. And it's also important for you, the citizens of Gotham, who will soon head to the polls to decide the future of your home, a city that's faced its share of hardships in recent years. Rising crime rates, income inequality, and yes, a mass vigilante loose on our streets. The candidates will tackle it all. we know why they weren't responding. Gordon, we found one of your patrols. They've been terminated. Oh, those goddamn so sons of... Sorry, ladies and gents. As you might have guessed, there's been a change to tonight's program. First order of business... Firing the moderator! I hate to be a downer, but these hostages... I don't like their chances. Oh, they just didn't have a head for the issues. If we're quick and decisive, no one else has to die. If you say so. But Penguin's playing for keeps. Fanatics always do. <gasps> You'll do. Get out here. Keep it Blue. quiet back there. These guys are armed to the teeth. Uh, we need a new moderator. Come on, you. You there. Yes! You! Oh, thank you for wait. volunteering! Please! No! Go on then! Introduce the candidates! Stage fright, huh? Alright, I'll get you started. But this is your show. Three hostiles. Gotta take them out quietly. Exactly to uh, the way I want it. Keep your heads down. Make for the police line. And now, a word from our sponsor. My dumb brothers and sisters of God. You have nothing to fear. We are the children of Arkham. We are here to end the masquerade and expose the corruption that ruined your city. For too long, men like your esteemed mayor 
are profiting from the pain of innocence. This is spiraling out of control. They have no idea about the man behind the mask. Whoever it is, they're smart. Let someone else get their hands dirty. Look into the hearts of these spineless creatures. Chosen to me. Go on, love. You know what to do. Certainly know how to make an entrance. Damn. The only thing is, I like the uh, I like the fabric suit better than the. Uh, 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 I know what you 
do. Where's your mate, Bruce Wayne? Your biggest supporter. And he didn't even turn yes. up. <laughs> Batman! The revolution's already started. It's too late to join. Damn you, Oswald, you jackass. Let Dent go. And what if I don't? I'll crush every bone in your body. I knew you'd say something like that. Oh, hey! Man, that would have hurt. Your half your face being singed off. Burn off. Singed off. City Hall is in chaos after Mayor Hamilton Hill was confirmed dead. While several members of the Children of Arkham have been arrested, the Penguin is still at large. Same after this. Meanwhile, the Wayne family scandal continued to escalate after the full list of Thomas Wayne's victims was released to the public. Don't trust your pet man. Don't do it. Can't trust her. She loves you, she just... You can't trust her. Lawyers representing Bruce Wayne have no comment at this time. We are the children of Arkham, and we have opened your eyes. What? It's really cool. Can't wait to start the next one. I appreciate you guys for watching. If you liked the video, hit the like button. Subscribe. Always have an awesome day. And I'll see you in the next one.